Okay, remember when actor Jesse Smollett claimed he was the victim of a violent hate crime and blamed it on Trump supporters? Well, that was, of course, later exposed as a hoax. But before all of the facts came out, then Senator Kamala Harris posted, Jesse Smollett is one of the kindest, most gentle human beings I know. I'm praying for his quick recovery. This was an attempted modern day lynching. No one should have to fear for their life because of their sexuality or color of their skin. We must confront this hate. To this day, she has not deleted that post. Now, the retired Chicago chief of detectives who helped expose the Jesse Smollett hoax is issuing a warning to voters. Eugene Roy joins me now. Eugene, good morning to you. So one of the things about becoming a presidential candidate is all of the past things that you've said become relevant once again. You know a whole lot about this Jesse Smollett story. What do you think about that tech, that tweet from Kamala Harris? Whether it's in a political office or a career service office, such as the police, is to never make a premature judgment, to never get out in front of the facts, to get out in front of a situation before all the facts are known. Especially when you're in a leadership position where people are hanging and take your word as, as your bond, to make a premature decision like that on a highly uh, emotional and inflamed situation, uh, it, it just... It's not appropriate. Yeah, I think that's really good advice for many members of, of Congress and, and people in government, not just her, but her included.